Hello and welcome to The Humble Seer. So today we're going to talk Gitmo or Guantanamo Bay and that is a military, United States military base and it's used to house uh, serious uh, criminals, very serious, the worst of the worst. People, for example, that may have committed 9-11, things like that. Now there's rumors that, um, but it's, it's not rumors actually, it's a fact that it's being built up and there's a courthouse being built there and there's um, a seating area, I guess, for journalists and whatnot. Uh, and, and that is in fact true. And a lot of administrations, well, plenty have wanted to talk about closing down Guantanamo Bay, but for some reason it never happens. And it's not meant to happen. Now, if you fast forward to today, uh, there's a lot of things going on in the world. And, um, you know, there's a lot of treason and sedition going on. And there will be people that will be tried for those things. And there will be people that will be executed for that crime of treason and sedition and other things. So there's no escaping that. Um, and there's a lot of things going on in the United States and in the world, but we're talking about the United States right now and Gitmo specifically. So Gitmo is going to be a place where um, politicians will be tried. I've seen that and known that for years. And, um, you know, you're tried, you're convicted, and you're either released or you're executed. And there will be executions, just so you know. And that's going to be hard for people to hear. Because there will be people that you are completely and fully familiar and aware with and you'll be in complete shock when you find out they were tried and convicted of these crimes and executed. Now, I'm not going to give names because it's just going to really upset people. And I'm not here to do that. I'm just here to prepare you as much as possible for the things that are coming sooner than you think. Um, and people will watch this video and a lot of them will prepare themselves for what is coming. And, uh, you know, it won't be easy, like I say, but there will be people that the world knows, the world knows their names in terms of politics that, and they will be tried and convicted. Some will go away to prison and some will be executed. It's just a fact that we have to live with. Something that uh, we have never seen before. I mean, there have been executions in this country, but nothing even remotely close to what we're going to experience here in the United States. And the United States is, it starts, things start in the United States and they spill out into other countries. You know, it's a cleanup is what's happening, is what I'm hearing. It's a cleanup and it's time and the world, we're moving into a new world, and it's a good world. You know, look at some of the videos that I've created about the CIA and um, the movie industry and things like that. You don't want to get into the music and movie industry right now. It won't be healthy for you, right? Because there's work that still needs to be done. Okay, but we're going to talk, we're going to pull a card and see what else we can glean from the cards about Gitmo. Okay, but like I say, it is uh, in being prepared, and it will be sooner than people think. And um, you know, some people will have to brace themselves for what's coming. Um, other people will be—I don't want to say fine, but I'm here. That's what I'm hearing. People will be fine with it um, because they know that a lot of really bad, nefarious things have gone on in this country and the globe, for that matter. But again, we're talking about the United States. So I'm going to pull a card to see what else we can glean. Okay. So we have the Five of Pentacles. The Five of Pentacles is about being left out in the cold, right? It's poverty, sickness, disease, loss. Okay. And that just speaks to what I, I was saying about, you know, it, there's going to be loss. There's going to be loss of life. Um. Now, this is, might upset some people, but I have to say it, okay? You see how this person is blindfolded? Well, when you're going to your executioner, for example, when you're being hanged, I think that's how you say it, um, you're blindfolded, okay? 
Oftentimes I use cards as a depiction. Now this is a very somber, very macabre, very, um, it's a very sad time right now that I'm, I just, it's, 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 it's difficult to do this reading. It really is. Um, let's pull one more card for Guantanamo Bay, AKA Gitmo. One more card, but it needs to be done. This needs to be done. It's long overdue. Okay. Now we have the swords. Seven of swords is lies, deception, unfair, arguments, treason, dishonesty. Okay, those are the words that if you were to look up seven of swords, you would find. Now, I find it interesting that we're talking about treason and sedition and that that word would actually be included in this card that we're talking about today. Okay? And we see that they have the weapons and they're saying, shh, because, you know, there's things that are going on that we don't have any awareness of right now. Even there's things that are going on behind the scenes that we don't have any clue about. All right, let's pull one more card. One more card. All right. We see how that flew out. And <laughs> that's interesting. I always like when the cards fly out like that. Okay, in the last card, oh, okay, well, it's the Ten of Wands. And the Ten of Wands really wanted to talk to us. Why? Because it's about effort. It's a massive undertaking. And there's a lot of sacrifices for success. It's huge, massive, okay? It's a, what is happening right now as it relates to Guantanamo Bay and crimes, crimes against humanity, really, it's a ten of wands. It's huge. It's stressful for people that are dealing with this. You know that have to that have to do this work. You know you have you have generals and you know things like people like that. But those people, soldiers, they have feelings, right? When they when they shut the door and they're behind closed doors, they may talk with them um, by themselves to themselves. They may talk to God. Um, generals have feelings, they're human, okay? The only person that I've come across that doesn't have any feeling, well, one of them I did a reading on, it's Logan, that Logan character. Um, I don't even remember his last name, but his, it's called Doomsday, the, it's Logan. Anyway, I digress somewhat. Um, they're not devoid of feeling is what I'm saying. So, yeah, to sum things up, Gitmo, is real it is being built up and you will <laughs> you will hear about things in the coming months now this is like the titanic it won't turn around in a day or a week but we're going to start hearing about things and seeing things soon and uh people just need to prepare themselves and if you can share this video consider doing so um some people won't believe what i'm saying they'll have a hard time believing it i'll admit that when i found out who was actually going to be you know executed i was shocked and in disbelief and it takes a lot to shock me and i've had that information for years so there you have it. I'm going to leave it there. Thank you so much for stopping by the Humble Seer. Do consider liking, sharing, subscribing, and leave a comment below. And if you really like what I do, you appreciate what I do, consider buying me a coffee. And you can find that information in the description box below. Until next time, you take good care and we'll talk again soon. Bye.